Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. My name is Susie, it's nice to meet ya. <laughs> I decided that I'm gonna take a self-care day and we're gonna do activities that not only care for my physical self, but also inside my mental health as well, because mental health is wealth. Basically, I have not been taking care of myself lately. I feel like I've been stressed out. I feel like I've been a bit disconnected from myself. So I thought we would reconnect and look after ourselves for a day because I feel like everyone needs a self-care day every once in a while. So first thing that I'm gonna do, which is one of my favorite things to do for myself, is go on a solo date to a cafe, have some healthy, yummy food. My friend Brie Lenahan does this all the time on Instagram and I started doing it because of her and I recommend it so much and then after that I'm gonna go get my nails done and a pedicure as well because toes are looking crusty dusty stinky dinky I think I'm gonna go get the Hailey Bieber nails like every other bitch out there but I'm basic what can I say I want to try it out before it becomes chuggy so this is what my nails are currently looking like that's nasty I've let them have a breather for long enough and I'm sick of it. I'm sick of my fingers looking like little nubs. So let's go to a cafe. <laughs> I'm at the nail place now and I just went to a cafe called Moo and Chic. I've never gone to it before, but oh my God, that was like the best Eggs Benedict I've ever had. It was delicious. My tummy is kind of rumbling now. Um, I probably shouldn't have drunk a full coffee right before I have to sit down for a couple hours and get my nails done. But whilst I was in the cafe, I just looked on Pinterest for like some toenail and nail inspo. And I just realized, I hope nobody was watching me save photos of toes. Like like no kink shaming or whatever, that probably would have looked a bit questionable if someone was to witness me doing that. Okay, I just got out, it's three o'clock now. Is it really only three o'clock? 3.16, that only took an hour for my pedicure and my manicure. That's pretty damn good. Those girls are amazing. I go to Vivid Nails in Canberra, in Lynham, for anybody wondering. I do need to wash my hands because the chrome is still around my fingers, but here are the Hailey Bieber nails. <laughs> girls that were working there had Hailey Bieber nails as well. The one that was doing my nails had like a pink version and then there was another girl with the white version. Apparently they've been doing them every single day. That's how popular they are. And my toes look good as well. I'm super happy feeling myself again. I'm feeling a 10 out of 10. I'm obsessed. Okay, let's drive home now. So one of the most important things that I do consistently for self-care is working out, moving my body, and this is to help my physical health but also mainly my mental health and every day before I go to the gym I'll have a bit of the Naked Harvest pre-workout in blueberry lemonade has been my favorite flavor lately before I go to the gym I take this especially if I'm feeling a little bit tired or I'm not feeling up to my workout it is so good for like getting you pumped, getting your body moving. And I feel like I perform so much better in the gym after I've had it. I'm very excited to now be partnering with Naked Harvest these days and they have kindly sponsored this video, but they're honestly something that I use every single day. I also really enjoy the great natural pre-workout. These are also sugar-free, gluten-free, dairy-free and vegan friendly. And they're nice and natural. It's literally the only pre-workout I've tried that doesn't make me feel ill. I 
used to not like pre-workout at all, but I literally live by this stuff now. And even more excitingly, Naked Harvest has just sent me a package with some new goodies. So I thought we could open up on here together. I love getting packages with exciting yummy things. Also love that their packaging is all recyclable. Ooh, 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 ooh. So they sent the natural pre-workout stim free. Ooh, they sent the sweet strawberry natural pre-workout flavor. I think I'm gonna have this before my workout today. I'm so excited for this. I love their protein so much. They gave me the caramel filled donut protein. Oh, so excited. I made some protein oats with their vanilla protein yesterday and it was mwah. And finally, I got a little pack of their adorable like rose gold, or is this copper? Scoops? Oh my God, you can clip it to the side of your protein bag. And you guys know I also obsess over their vanilla maple chai moon milk. Literally have this almost every single night. It tastes like a chai latte and it doesn't have any sugar in it. It's got magnesium, so it helps you get to sleep. And magnesium is good for sore muscles. So instead of taking my magnesium tablets, I can just have one of these and it's way yummier. But yeah, I love Naked Harvest so much. I will have all of these things linked down below and you can use code SUSY15 for 15% off Naked Harvest. By the way, that is an affiliate link. So it means if you use it, I do get a small commission and I would really appreciate it. I've tried multiple supplement brands and Naked Harvest continues to be my favorite and I would not recommend it if it wasn't something I was using all the time. But now I'm gonna make some of this sweet strawberry natural pre-workout and we can try this flavor for the first time. So Just gave my scoop a little rinsey rinse. Oh, that smells like a, smells like a starburst lolly. And just shake her up. Taste test. Oh, that is so good. I think I like that even more than the blueberry. Mm. 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 I just drink this like 15 to 30 minutes before I work out just so it kicks in properly. But thank you so much to Naked Harvest for sponsoring this portion of the video. Mwah. Now I'm just going on a little sunset hot girl walk. It's pretty cold to be honest, so I'm kind of hoping I work up a sweat, but I've been neglecting my hot girl walks lately. I feel like they're so good just to, <sighs> why am I already out of breath? I feel like they're so good just to clear your mind. You can put a podcast in, listen to some music, or just listen to the sounds of nature. I'm gonna just not listen to anything for a bit. And then maybe when I get a bit bored of that, I'll put some music on. Cause I feel like it's good to just have no stimulation for a bit, like they did in the olden days. <laughs> I'm just at a little bush spot near my house. There's a bunch of little hiking trails around here and I haven't walked here in months and it's a really nice walk. So I'm gonna try start doing this more often. And I mean, this is good for your physical health, but it's also good for your mental health. That's mostly why I'm doing it. One hour later. I highly underestimated how long this walk would take me. And it's dark now. I'm kind of freaking out, but I'm trying not to. Oh my God. That was so wholesome at the beginning. And then the second the sun started going down, it was instant regret. I don't think I've ever walked that trail that fast in my entire life. Like that was a world record. Oh no, I need to pee 
so relaxing. I honestly don't really like baths, but I thought I'd do it for the aesthetic of the video. I think it's because this is a child's bathtub. <laughs> I can't fit in it properly. First thing I'm gonna do is wash my dirty, greasy, dandruffy hair. Cue the relaxation music. Maybe I should wash my hair first in the shower. I just washed my hair in the shower. And I'm gonna put on this 10 minute hair mask from Georgie Main. Oh, that smells lovely. That smells lovely. Oh yeah. And we're of course gonna do a face mask. So I'm gonna use this Mask of Magnamity from Lush, which is probably out of date. Oh. She's small and sour. Simba. It's giving chunky Shrek diarrhea after he ate some nuts. I love it. I'm also gonna do some exfoliation. So I got this rose hip body scrub and cleanser from Frank Body. I like how this lathers. Hopelessly devoted to you. Okay, my camera's about to die, so I'm just gonna finish shaking. Maybe listen to a bit of music. Not bad. Not bad. I am feeling so soft and delectable right now. We of course need to moisturize, so I'm gonna try out this rose hip dry body oil. I'm just gonna use this to moisturize my freshly shaved legs, which also I think my razor was a bit blunt because I'm definitely <laughs> getting some razor burn. That's not ideal. And I'm wearing the most comfortable pajama combo to ever exist. A pair of the saggiest, oldest, most faded undies you own and a massive t-shirt. I also just changed my sheets so they are so clean. Today has been bliss. And I'm gonna do my favorite little trick which is putting a crap ton of moisturizer on my feet and then putting socks on to soak in all of that moisture goodness. I really never thought I would be one to have crusty heels, but here we are. It happens to the best of us. Completely emulsified the foot. I'm surprised the nail salon lady didn't put the potato peeler on these. <laughs> taking my medicine because it's important to look after our mental health. I also keep this massive two liter bottle of water next to my bed because I'm always thirsty for some reason. And also spraying a bit of sleep mist. <coughs> so now I'm just setting my alarms and putting my phone on do not disturb and I'm not gonna go on it for the rest of tonight. And instead of watching TikToks until I fall asleep, I'm going to read. I've been reading this book, The Thursday Murder Club by Richard Osman. I've been highly enjoying it. So I'm probably gonna read this for like the next 30 minutes until I fall asleep. And that is the end of my self-care day. And boy, do I feel good. If you're watching this, I encourage you to take a self-care day because you deserve it. It's really nice to just look after me for a while. done reading now. It's time to go to sleep. Thank you for joining me on this self-care day. If you enjoyed, please leave a like and also subscribe if you haven't already and join our family of all shapes and sizes. You are welcome here. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys. Night night.